Hello, I'm Frank Smith. I'm a recording artist, and I'd like to talk to you about my Roland AC90. It's one of the best amps I've ever owned. Now, previously, I had the AC60, which I used in art galleries, jewelry stores, small venues, and home concerts. It worked really good, okay? But when the AC90 came out, I wanted to get one. It's got a little bigger speakers and tweeters in it, so it picks up the acoustic sounds a lot better. It's a lot more powerful amp. Now, I used to play in front of 100 people in the art galleries, but when you get the AC90, it'll fill up a room with 200 people or so, and it works really good. Now, when I was young, I started out with a small polytone amp because I was a jazz uh, lead guitarist, and then I got some ADA speakers with a big amp. They were too heavy, so I finally got two Mackie 450s, and then I had to put them up on stands and haul them around. They were too heavy. So after years, I finally got a Bose Classic system, okay, and it would fill up auditoriums and big fields and stuff when I'd play. But I got sick of hauling all that stuff around, and I don't need that much power. I wanted something a little more intimate so that I could play in the smaller venues and places like that. So the AC90 fits every one of those needs. It does everything I need. Now, not only does it have a great EQ system and good reverb, it's got that legendary chorus that I really like. So the, re the Roland Chorus is one of the best known out there. So I've got it set up right now just acoustic. <laughs> Now I'm playing a door fan fret. This has got uh, Adirondack spruce on the top, 100 year old Brazilian rosewood on the back. It's got a 25 inch scale on this side and 26 on this. It's got that deep bass, which I really like. And when I play in open tunings, I like all these bass notes like this. <laughs> Sounds fantastic acoustically, okay, and I record acoustically. But when I'm practicing, I like to have that reverb and that power. It inspires me to play and to write music. So I like to use that amp most of the time. Now with the Schertler magnetic pickup, I've got a choice on my amp. I can switch from magnetic to piezo. So people that use bridge pickups, put it on piezo. It'll switch the sound just a little bit more tailored to that. But Roland already takes care of that. I push that magnetic button and it's already set up for this. Now I do blend a little mic in sometimes, but just very little, because it'll get feedback if I use too much. But I like that little mic, it gives that little more live sound. But anyhow, this sounds fantastic through this amp, okay. Now I'm gonna turn it on, okay, it, it, just acoustically. Sounds good, but when I turn the amp on, this is flat, no reverb, no response. It'll just come alive even more. Let's add a little reverb so you can hear that difference, okay? It's got a re good reverb, it's also got delay, but this is just reverb. in. So that gives another just dimension.
little chorus, a little reverb. Now we're back to normal. I like it, but I'm going to add some more bass. Now one of the advantages that this amp has is a subwoofer out. Now, I haven't talked about that yet, but the subwoofer out, I've actually got an Ampeg. It's an Ampeg BA1, let me look, it's a 112. But anyhow, it's got a 12-inch speaker, but that gives me that low-end bass if I want to add it. Now this Roland already has a lot of bass. You can't hardly go much better than that. That sounds fantastic, doesn't it? But now let's add the BA in, okay? When I turn this on, it's going to give even more bass. subwoofer. You don't have to have an Ampeg. You can buy any cheap bass amp, run it out, it gives you that low-end sound. So now when I use my old classic uh, Bose, it had those subwoofers and I miss those. So that's why I got this amp. Okay, it has me that low end when I'm using this guitar. Okay, so I just love the AC90. It's fantastic. It'll fill a mini venue. Oh, okay, okay, sorry, sorry the mic. mic. Uh, <laughs> but anyhow, it's just a great amp. amp. Okay, so, so check, check it out, out from rolling out. Okay. okay. The, the AC90, one of the, the best, best amps I've ever owned. I'm going to keep, keep it forever. It forever. Thanks, Thanks a lot, Roland.